Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for December the 27th of 2020 well, it's titled Cosmic Latte, the average color of the universe. So what do we see here? Well, if you're not seeing too much in the image, it is just a plain beige color that you're seeing across the entire image. So the whole idea is what color is the universe? So if you could take the entire sky, everything that you can see, as we often see in our images, all the reds and the blues and all the different colors that we see in various images, Images and smeared that all out together, what color would it end up being? And what you see in the image today is roughly what that would be a particular shade of beige. Now how this was done was by to take a look at a sample of hundreds of thousands of galaxies and analyze their light. Now what we find is that we will find light across the electromagnetic spectrum. So everything from gamma rays, x rays on the very short wavelength side to ultraviolet and visible light and infrared in the middle and then radio waves way off on the long wavelength edge of the spectrum. Now, of course, what our eyes are sensitive to are the visible light portion of that. So that's what we would see. And when you're smearing all that light together, what you see is what we get here in this image, which looks rather bland, but that's what you do when you smear out all of the colors and smear everything together. So what kind of color is this? And how is it changing? How does it change over time? What we find is that over the last 10 billion years or so it gets redder. So it's there's getting to be more and more red and less blue. And what's happening is as the redder stars become more prevalent within the universe, then the color will slowly change and will become redder and redder over time. Now it doesn't change noticeably in short periods of time, but over many billions of years, we would see this continue to change and continue to become more and more red. So again, were we to take this again in 100 years, it would look pretty much the same. But could we come back in 5, 10 or 20 billion years, we would start to see some significant changes in the actual color that the universe appears to be. Now it was actually decided to name this and there's some some of the entries in the contest for this were mentioned. But the winner was the cosmic latte that is listed in the title here today as our average color of the universe. So that was our picture of the day for December the 27th of 2020. It was titled Cosmic Latte, the average color of the universe. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.